NDIS demand pushes vets down mental health queue. Veterans are being forced onto months-long waiting lists to get mental health support under a rebate system that pays at least $61 less per session to treat former ADF members than NDIS clients. Caro, this coming, this news landing on the day of the 50th anniversary of, you know, the Vietnam, everything that the Vietnam vets went through, and now this, where we have people like uh, Philip Thompson, uh, Jackie Lambie, Andrew Hastie in the, in the coalition, all trying to say we need to make sure that the mental health and the mental and, and emotional health of vets is first and foremost, and now this lands. Yeah, precisely. And uh, it was the Labor Party who was very much uh, behind a Royal Commission into veteran suicide. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure whether they're interested in it because of the actual veteran suicide or whether it was a great political wedge. But anyway, mm -hmm. they were at the time. Well, this is the stuff that actually matters. This here, being able to get uh, the appropriate mental health support within a timely fashion um, is what prevents or, or at least lessens the chance of of it ending very, very badly. Mm. Um, I don't understand why there would be a different categorisation for something like this. But we've historically uh, not treated our veterans particularly well. Mm. And when you think about the number of outstanding claims they have against the Commonwealth, um, it's, it's just absolutely extraordinary. And then, you know, you see something like the Higgins case and how quickly that was settled by the Commonwealth last year. Mm. Well, I think that we should be providing uh, similar solutions to our veterans. Yeah, absolutely, given all of the hullabaloo mm. that's happening mm -hmm. within and, our neighbourhood and backyard. And, Jenna, at the same time... Go ahead, Lise. And at the same time, you, at the same time, you've got Labor saying no to a request for the Royal Commission to have an extra 12 months because it is such a complex and yeah. important issue. So we aren't doing yeah. the right thing by our veterans. They've, if you talk to the, the guys who are, and women who are over there in Afghanistan, they've lost more mates here post the war than yeah. they did actually yeah. in country fighting for the fighting for Australia. Yeah. So it is just it just stinks. Yeah.